found a great guy, but he just can't seem to be there for you the way you need him to be? Is he dragging his feet, unwilling to commit to you in any real way? Making a guy jealous never fails to make men do a complete 180. That's because it activates the hunter center of his brain, which makes him want to win your love and trust any way he can. And the best part is, he doesn't even have any idea why. Hi, I'm Lucy Goldman, romance coach for Love Learnings TV. I'm gonna give you some powerful text messages to make any man jealous. All you have to do is copy and paste and watch him completely transform from distant and non-committal to excited to see you as much as possible. The trick to making men jealous is to be subtle. If he can tell you're trying to make him jealous, it won't work. It'll actually have the complete opposite of the intended effect. Another important element is to leave questions unanswered. Give him just enough information to make him curious. He'll fill in the blanks and this will make him even more jealous than if he knew exactly what you're doing. Now, with this in mind, let's talk about our first jealousy text. Sorry, I have plans. This one is simple yet effective. It accomplishes several things. First, it lets him know that he's not your only priority. This is especially important with guys who won't treat you right or commit to you the way that you deserve. Next, it tells him that you're busy, but you won't tell him why. His mind will run wild in this situation. Is she mad at me? Is she seeing someone else? Don't elaborate and let him try to figure out where you are and more importantly, who you're with. It's important to be vague and let him fill in the gaps. Here's another jealousy-inducing text. I've been out for dinner too much this week. Let's just stay in. This is a great text. Not only does it tell him that you're low maintenance and relaxed, it makes him wonder about your dinner companions. Now, if these don't work, take a more direct approach. Here are a few to use when he compliments you. You know, everyone seems to agree with you this week. Or, you sound just like my coworker Greg. Or even, thanks, I'm almost afraid to wear this outfit in public after the reactions I got today. Mentioning other men can be a slap in the face to jealous guys, but sometimes that's just what they need. With this text, you're saying, you're not special and I do have other options, but this will activate his insecurity and make him take action to get closer to you. Do you have trouble texting men you like? There's no shame in it. Texting is a new form of communication and it really does take practice. That's why Amy North offers a crash course in texting. Go to attractiontext.com now to learn the secret to make men clamor to be close to you. Now, on to our next jealousy causing text. Okay, this one can backfire, but if you use it sparingly, it'll drive him wild. My ex used to say, this one is not word for word. You need to find the proper time and place to use it. The point of this text is to just mention your ex and that's it. It shouldn't be about how much better your ex is than him or how your ex was an asshole and you hate him. It's just about introducing him as a former presence in your life. It's important to do this without being too obvious. Wait for him to mention something that reminds you of your ex before dropping this in. The right guy will recognize that your ex was a part of your life and he'll be happy you're comfortable mentioning him. But, by the same token, he won't be able to control his primal surge of jealousy that'll fill him when you mention his name. Limit this one or it'll look like you're still hooked on your ex. Trust me when I say any mention of your ex will activate his hunter instinct, whether he knows it or not. Shifting gears for a moment, did you know that you can make your man jealous by texting other people? There are plenty of ways to create jealousy in him by texting other people. This is only possible if you two have mutual friends, especially friends that are closer to him than they are to you. I'm not telling you to hit on his friends necessarily. Just drop subtle hints that you might be seeing someone else and that you're available. Don't talk about him or ask about him. In essence, you want this friend to get the sense that he's not that important to you. You can even mention being single if you are. This is a risky move, but what you're doing is laying the groundwork for jealousy. If this is someone that your man comes to for advice, then the chances are you're going to come up at some point. And when you do, you want this friend to give the indication that you're not head over heels for him, and if he's not careful, he just might lose you. Another way to make him jealous is to text other people when you two are hanging out. This one is risky though. Do it too often and you'll look self-involved. 
but trust me when I say he's going to wonder who you're texting in bed with him late at night, and that is for sure going to make him jealous. Here's an easy one that you can use at any time. I had such a crazy weekend, or this week has been crazy, but so much fun. Or even, man, I could use a day at home. I've been really burning the candle at both ends lately. This one is more subtle, but you need to give the indication that you have a full life and that he's just a small part of it. An ideal partner will like you more for having interests outside of him, but he's not gonna be able to help being a little jealous and subconsciously work harder to earn a bigger place in your life. So by now, you can tell that these texts are designed to elicit insecurity and jealousy in your man without him even knowing that that's your intention. You can call it manipulation, but you know what they say, love is a battlefield, and sometimes you gotta bring out the big guns. These are tactics that I'd only recommend quite early on in a relationship when you're worried he's losing interest or he's hanging around but unwilling to commit to something more real with you. If used correctly, these texts can be a game changer, but just know that there is always a risk that he might take offense. Navigating dating is especially difficult in the social media-driven world. Looking to connect on a human level and build a real connection with a guy? You're in luck. Go to coachnorth.com right now for a free video presentation that will cover the fundamentals of how to put your best foot forward in the dating world. It's not about being fake or playing games. It's about using proven methods to attract men and make them wild with desire for you. Now, that's coachnorth.com. Don't wait. There's a woman connecting with her dream man right now with Amy's advice. You could be the next success story. Thanks for watching. If you found any of this helpful, please like this video and subscribe to Love Learnings TV. We've gotten a ton of hilarious and informative new videos that are set to be released really soon. I'm Lucy Goldman for Love Learnings TV. See you next time.